how things go bad uh, later in the afternoon. It's been going on since noon, and we do see some tempers really starting to flare. The crowd is not dispersing. They are not following the order orders of the police officers and uh, vandalism of the vehicles. We've seen some officers have been struck by what appeared to be uh, paint cans thrown at them. We see individuals now vandalizing the police cars. Uh, this is getting uh, out of control. It looks like LAPD is trying to move in now and disperse this crowd. But boy, that can become a huge problem uh, and be very difficult when a crowd starts to get unruly. Now, what LAPD has done, though, is they did not allow the three groupings of this crowd, if you will, uh, the three different areas that the crowd formed at, to come together. They've set up lines, and they're trying to keep these three large areas where the crowd has formed away from each other so the size of the crowd uh, doesn't get too overwhelming for police to handle. But you can tell there's a lot of battling going on right now between uh, LAPD officers in full riot gear and the crowd here. They are getting to the point where they are refusing to obey the orders of the officers. Uh, we've seen one officer, at least, if not several officers, be struck. We have seen uh, them have to move in and try and get the crowd to move and uh, shoot uh, beanbag uh, rounds at some of the individuals here. We haven't seen any tear gas yet, tear gas. We saw that a little bit uh, last night, but the crowd is getting unruly. This individual